Hello guys, this is going to be my second tutorial on how to make another car follow you, your car. So, to start, by the way, this project is the project I used in the first tutorial. So, if you have not seen the first tutorial, go to the link in the description and then look at it and look at my first tutorial. Okay, so now, to start off with, add a car, and then relate it to the terrain, the car, and the g-force, and add it to any location you want. I'm going to add it to this location, you perhaps can turn it like this, just check if it works. Do not relate to the cam chase because you don't want your camera chasing the opponent's car. You want your car chasing your car. Okay. So. Now. Add a. Car AI. But first. Do not get confused. Rename the first car. The car that you're gonna play, car player, like I'm doing, and add the make the other car, the one that you just added. Actually, the one that you added second, last, car opponent. So now press OK, and then you should have car player and car opponent. Now to um just um double click the car opponent and detect the throttle, detect the re reverse, and um detect the turn left and right. Oh wait, I I um pronounced it wrong. P make the this detect into untick. Then, so now, the car AI, AI mode, you're going to have to change it, unless you want your, your car to avoid the other car. Ch chase means that it's going to go on your path, but it's not going to really go there directly. Target is going to go there directly, and it's going to target you. And flee is just, just flee. So your car is gonna flee. So I'm gonna put target in since that's the easiest to do. Well, the others are easy, but um, it's it's um, it's um, harder to um, do avoid because um, the other car will not is not that sensitive to your car. So then, relate to the car opponent and the car player. And now, change the ignore on car opponent to drivable vehicle. And change the car player to obstacle and target. And just make sure that um, you've got everything. Oh wait, you can change the speed. Which will be very helpful to check if it works. And then just check if everything works. And um, that everything is ticked the way it is. And then try the game. Now the other player will try to follow you. I'm going to stand still and see, and I'm, I'm going to show you what it does. See? You have just made an opponent follow your car.